Hello everybody, my name is Luigi Pengaro, I'm a motion graphics designer and sometimes I'm a filmmaker. And today I'm going to show you how to do the track mat effect. What this allows you to do is to have words on the screen and you can see the footage underneath those words. Pretty cool. Okay, let's get started. Let's create a new sequence file, new sequence. And let's stick it at 1080p because our footage is 1080p it's best to keep everything within the same resolution and let's just call it uh, sequence one for now press ok and let's import our footage onto our timeline let's drag this onto video one zoom in for a little bit so we can see what we're doing and this is the shot of Valletta Harbour in Malta which I shot as part of my products called stock reel which is um, cheap high quality footage for filmmakers documentarians and journalists and amateur filmmakers alike which will be coming out soon so we have our footage and this will be the footage that we have we'll see under our text so we need to create some text so we go to file new title and let's keep it the same resolution 1920 by 1080 because that is the same resolution as our footage and of our sequence let's keep it uh, title free will be doing for now for this example and we entered the title creation window so let's grab type tool and let's type in something of course let's go for the the uh, blockbuster thing, um, like in TV and film, Valletta, um, Malta, in all capital letters, and let's choose a different font. We need a font that uh, is thick, that's bold, like Arial Bold looks nice, and maybe we should go for something like Impact. See if we can find Impact right over here. Good, nice strong text. And let's change the size of this maybe to about 205, I think. Yes. And let's center it in here. And of course, for your own projects, you can write whatever you want and have any other footage behind it as you want. So, so, it's, so the most important thing is we need big, thick text in order to make this effect stand out more. And let's center it like that and press click out of it and it will save one other important thing to note when you create the text for this effect is keep the font color white it's important that we choose white because the track matte effect chooses the pixels which are white to base its transparency so anything which is white in our title layer will appear transparent and the our original footage will appear underneath all right now let's get our new title and let's drag it on top of our footage and let's extend the time to the end of the footage which is about 10 seconds and let's put some motion to this text in order to do that we click on the um, the title we go to effects controls up here go to motion we set a keyframe by clicking on the stopwatch and then we move the timeline to about end let's play with this number with the scale until we get a decent size like that okay 205 for now and it will create two keyframes and we can even smooth it around smooth it by selecting these two shift click or drag them right click and let's go ease in so it'll be a lot more smoother the next step is we need to go to effects controls and we're going to search for an effect called track matte key and we're going to place this track matte key effect onto our footage not on the title but on the footage itself and if we go to effects controls it's added track mat key and the only thing we need to change is this mat and this would and this enables to choose what layer what track 
will be our mat and we simply choose the one that's on top so video number two and there we go one thing you can do in order to make your life more easy is to rename the tracks so let's go let's unclick these click video number one let's re right click it rename and let's call it uh, footage let's drag it so we can seal it better and video number two let's right click it rename and let's call it text so therefore when you click on the original footage you go to track map T you can actually select the text track which corresponds to that to that just to make our lives a lot more easier let's render this out and see what we have got so we're going to select it we're going to hit enter and through the magic of editing it has finished rendering this is what we have created Well, that's it. That is how we create text where you can see the footage underneath. A very simple effect. It's called Track Mat and it looks super cool and very professional. And I hope this tutorial has been useful to you. And if it has been useful, please share this video tutorial online in social media so we can help others. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.